Today's day, what is today? Tuesday, today's day two. <laughs> uh. Light shine bright, everywhere we go. Musical my name is Tessie, and this is my Light son Hunter. Bright. This everywhere is go. our story. Um, just wanted to update real fast. Had the funnest experience. I got into radiation today, running behind the weather, it caused several accidents on the interstate. Here's my lizard skin for any updates. Basically, looks the same that it always does. I have a little bit more red color to my skin now, so kind of like it. It's good with my pink this week. Got to figure out how to make the spots uh, work. I should have heart masks. <laughs> I need to stop talking. Okay. So, my radiation team was playing Cardi B <laughs> when I got in there. They totally jammed it up all day today. It was awesome. Uh, dancing and everything. So, I just love the amazing people I've met in this journey. I had lots of laughs. But I will say, because I was laughing, it might stand out more. I don't think that's what it is. Um, in yesterday's video before radiation, I had said that I could feel my jaw was starting to hurt and I was having some side effects. It's definitely... Um, definitely present it doesn't hurt the same as my chemo my chemo mouth sores and I've done you an injustice by not posting this shit I'm working on a really great chemo video for you guys um, I had some mouth sores that were really hard I felt like anytime if I drank something acidic or that my mouth didn't like something that had any texture to it it feel like glass was just all in my mouth um, so when my mouth sores started, sores started coming back this week I was afraid I was going down that path again knowing I have three weeks of radiation left. Um, my doctor yesterday confirmed the mucositis, mucositis, <laughs> um, and he told me this is when the side effects. He told me yesterday, he said, today is officially the day you start hating me. <laughs> I was like, I'll never hate you. And he said, yes, you will. So whatever that entails, but I will, the mass today, um, I could feel constant um, radiation well that's not the right word to use but a not throbbing per se but the pressure on I know my jaw is swollen on this side I could feel it even more so under the mask and my jaw is extremely sore right now I'm just where there was like a constant pressure on this whole side of my face during my radiation today so I'm gonna go take some ibuprofen I was supposed to take some before radiation I talked about that with my doctor yesterday I forgot to do it so Gonna take some radiation. Gonna take some radiation. Gonna take some ibuprofen. And I'm gonna go take a nap. I clearly need one. So I don't know if you got this like I did. Probably not. We're all our human insecurities and how we overjudge everything we do. Like, do we blink too much? <laughs> um, but I was making this noise. Uh, it's not normal. I'm not crazy. Um, but it's, I just did it. <laughs> It's from where my, I am losing my salivatory glands, salivatory glands. I'm losing those due to the radiation. So it's going to cause me to lose my toast, uh, my, it's going to cause me to lose my taste buds. And the reason I'm not recutting all this and showing you how tongue twisted and confused I am is it's totally a side effect. Um, this is not normal. I hope to regain how quick and sharp I can be once I'm finished with treatments. But I'm definitely not, this is, I've, this is one thing I struggle with the most, as a matter of fact, is I like to juggle a lot of things and to get so confused and not be able to catch something quickly um, is probably one of the hardest things for me to struggle with personally right now. But anyways, the um, sound is because I'm losing my salivatory glands, salivatory glands. And um, so I don't have, I'm gonna get, I get cotton mouth. It's gonna continue to get worse. I've already noticed it. Um, one thing that my doctor recommended, and everybody's doctor is different, so check with them, but mine recommended Gatorade, and I got some, and it was heaven sent. I'm a water girl, I would never pick Gatorade, but it was, I was really glad I went with it because I think that's gonna get me through a lot of this. So my mouth is definitely dry. I'm having to do that weird mouth thing all the time just to feel like I can swallow. I've got the uh, reverse cough going on, so I sound like a miniature dog that's choking when I'm around people. It makes for good looks. And uh, when I sneeze. And, um, oh, and I'm getting nosebleeds. So I talked about that a little bit, I think, in a video. My nose is actually bleeding today before radiation. So I was in the bathroom taking care of that right before. It's just 
the yucky weather along with the um, pressure that my sinuses and stuff are being put under right now. So that's an update. Still in great spirits. I honestly feel better, um, <laughs> as weird as that sounds, because I think my body's finally coming up from the chemo. So uh, I'll take the ache in my jaw and I'll take feeling like I have to take a nap in the afternoons. I don't have my son today. So what's wrong with that, right? I worked hard. Here, here. <laughs> Just finished radiation on the third day, week three. So I'm not quite halfway done. I'll be done on Friday halfway, um, which is two more days. So week three out of five, or week, day two out of five. <laughs> Anyways, um, my jaw is throbbing. So I can see how by week six, this is gonna be real fun. <laughs> Other than that, I have no complaints. I feel like I'm, um, getting healthier during the mornings I feel really good right after radiation it does kind of knock me on my butt so I've just started making arrangements for that I don't have my son this week so it's not been that hard I get to stay in Knoxville with a friend um, with my Jesse Fry so that's been good really no complaints everything's about the same my nose is still bleeding I had another nosebleed this morning um, but my jaws is hurting definitely worth documenting so um, I did take my ibuprofen today before I went in. Maybe that'll kick in here in a minute and help me out. So. Oh yeah, and my hair is coming back kind of fiercely. Like I've got full eyebrows and nice eyelashes. I mean, not they're not all the way, but they're like baby eyelashes. And then I got like some like fur going on up here. <laughs> Woof. Watch out, ladies. It's Valentine's. <laughs> so it's Valentine's today. I just finished radiation, so I've got one day left of this week, and then I'm halfway done. Um, but check this out. It was so fun. So I'm a nerd, if you haven't figured that out yet. <laughs> um, and I love holidays, and I love to be goofy around holidays. I've worn pink all week. I'm wearing hearts today. Um, I just think it's people relax a little bit on holidays and I think it's fun to just bring that out and be silly and let people have reasons to smile and let all their stress go because this world can be stressful but um so fun because I did kind of this for everybody today but look my radiation team look what they gave me oreo balls and they made me this card it's so cute this says you're one in a melon UT loves you oh um, no complaints. My jaw's a little sore. Nothing like it was yesterday. So ibuprofen seemed to work and really nothing new. I mean, there's definitely some stuff going on with my mouth, but not really a change from earlier this week. I guess I'm just kind of used to it. Definitely not worse. So I'll check in tomorrow. Halfway done. <laughs> Halfway done today. So happy. Um, I have noticed some changes. My jaw is um, still hurting, mouth getting more sore where food isn't as fun to eat. Um, and it's starting to happen on the roof of my mouth now. So, um, still making that weird sound. And, um, now my tongue is like sticking. Oh, <laughs> so my mouth is getting more dry. Um, you're going to get to where you carry like a bottle of water or Powerade around all the time. And, um, so right before they put my mask on, I usually kind of like rub over my face and lick my lips. Well, um, my lips had like stuck together. So right as they were putting my mask on, I tried to move them <laughs> and they got caught like weird under my mask. <laughs> so then I was like trying to like move my lips under my mask to get them to fit right. I felt like I was a, like a mule up against a glass window. So I would not recommend doing that. <laughs> Make sure your face is where you want it to be before they put their mask on. Um, check out my shirt. I'm wearing a blonde shirt and going bald today with my new GI Jane here. I know I'm not right. Anyways, great news. Halfway done. I'll let you know how the mouth situation is on Monday, week four. And if anything else happens. Thanks for watching, guys. Remember to subscribe, hit the alert button, and follow my crazy family. Don't forget to let your light shine.